Well, hello, I'm Elizabeth Robbins, and I thought I would share with you how I set up my still lives. I get asked that question a lot of times when I uh, go teach. So what I do is I have a hospital table that um, can rise and lower depending on what perspective I want in my setup. So if I want more of an eye level, I can raise this up and it goes pretty high. If I want a perspective where I'm looking a little bit further down on it, then I can lower it. I love having that function. I've then just gotten a, um, a board from like Home Depot and I've stained it and I put it on top for the, the surface of my paintings. And so then what I've done is I've made three or two different sides of boxes, three sided. These are just masonite panels that are or, um, hinged together. You can also just go buy some cheap foam core and you know, cut them into three sides and tape them together with duct tape and you'll have the same thing. So here's a, a small box that I use for small setups and depending on how much you know, light, if I've got the light coming from this side, uh, depending on how much I open that wing, it lets a lot of light in. If I close it, it kind of gets a little bit darker on this side from where the light's coming from. Then I also will have a, a board that I will put on top Again, depending, if, if I don't have the board, you can see how much lighter the background is. If I want that really strong light shadow, then I'll add that board and that, that background gets a lot darker. So this is what I use for my, my small setups, and then I have a larger one for larger setups. And I have just painted them um, with a dark and a mid-tone um, olive green. If I um, want to put a fabric or change the color, I'll, let me just go grab a piece of fabric. You know, I can drape fabric um, over the back of it and change the color fairly easy. Put that back up. And now I have kind of a dark burgundy background. So then I have my light. This is a, just a cool light that comes in and I can higher or lower the light depending on the lighting effect that I want my still life, and that's how I do it. So I hope that was helpful. Thanks.